Local leaders turned out tonight for a panel discussion called the state of our youth. They wanted to address what should be done in Hamilton County schools to keep students safe. Our Jemiah Beatty joins us live in the studio with this story. Jemiah. A lot of concerned parents and teachers say they want to see more done after recent incidents involving SROs. But to do that, they believe it starts with trust and consistency. We've been saying for a long time that our kids matter. We need to work together. And at this point, I'm a realist. It's a broken record to me. The State of Our Youth event allowed community members to express their concerns about SROs and student behavior in the schools. It was sparked by what they saw in this video of an altercation between an SRO and a student at East Ridge High School last month. Chattanooga Police Chief Celeste Murphy, District Attorney Cody Womp, and County Mayor Weston Womp joined in to share how they hope to ensure every child's safety. They say the first step is to vet school resource officers. They say it's important students know they have a mental Tour they can trust in a time of need. Coming from a sense of um, not wanting to um, lock people up, you know, you want to have that mentor, that you want to have that person there that relates, someone that's even possibly from the community to be working with these children. Chief Murphy says having an SRO who knows the students can help alleviate some of the fear students may have. But outside the classroom, finding ways to deter students from committing crimes can change a student's life. District Attorney Cody Womp, who often sees some of the city's youth after they've been taken in, says it's never their goal to harm a student's record. We don't put scars on our juveniles' records. Uh, we want to make sure that they can go out and be productive still, even if they go through the juvenile justice system. In the long run, this is not just an issue to be solved in the schools, but in the community. County Mayor Weston Womp says his office is working to add more programs to support the city's youth. 